Greetings and welcome to this virtual conference, Living Charisms, Sisters Leadership for Human Flourishing. Karibu sana for our Swahili speakers. <laughs> this event is sponsored by the Loyola Institute for Ministry, or LIM, at Loyola University, New Orleans in the USA, with the support of a grant from the Conrad N. Hilton Foundation Catholic Sisters Initiative. My name is Sarah DeMarais. I work at LIM and manage our theological education projects for Catholic sisters, including our current project titled Living Charisms for Sustainable Human Development. Today, our topic is Trauma-Informed Ministries for Vulnerable Youth. Our presenters are Catholic sisters who have earned LIM's Certificate in Catholic Social Teaching. They recently took LIM's course called Trauma-Informed Care for Vulnerable Youth, and they created partnerships with youth-serving ministries in their congregations. They facilitated learning and evaluation processes and collaboratively wrote strategic plans for improving the ministries. Today, they will share some of the wisdom gained through these experiences. Briefly to begin, I'd like to share some of the foundational ideas behind this project, since you will hear these terms throughout the sisters' presentations. First, all these projects are inspired by and rooted in Catholic social teaching, or CST, meaning the Catholic Church's social traditions, those related to justice, peace, human dignity, and the common good. CST advocates for integral human development. Development is integral when it advances the development of the whole person and every person. This approach stands in contrast to some approaches to development that treat the person as only an economic agent or as a consumer or approaches that neglect the most poor and vulnerable. The ministries you'll hear about today strive for the integral development of young people, promoting holistic wellness in mind, body, and spirit. For young people who have survived challenging situations, trauma-informed care is essential. Trauma can be understood as any experience that overwhelms a person's ability to cope. Trauma-informed ministries promote healing by ensuring young people's safety and promoting connection through nurturing relationships, voice, and participation. The LIM students presenting today have promoted integral human development and trauma-informed care, inspired by Catholic social teaching and each congregation's distinctive missions and charisms. Today, they will share advice for improving services for youth based on their studies and their partnerships. We will now hear from each of our five presenters. While watching, you are welcome to ask questions using the Q&A function in Zoom. You should see it along the bottom bar. You can click Q&A and then submit a question by typing. After all of the presentations, we will bring all presenters together on screen for a discussion, and we will try to answer as many of your questions as possible. Thank you for being with us today. 